Good morning YouTube. This is Sean with Hiking with Sean. And today I'm going to do something a little different. Today I'm not going to hike. Um, I got to go to work late tonight and I figure I'd make, at least make a video for this week um, since I'll be returning to work. And I thought for today I'd do a gear video to show you all what type of uh, gear I take with me on my hikes. So that's what we're gonna do today. I hope you enjoyed this video and thanks for watching. And there you have my gear. But all this mess of different resources is what I put in this fanny pack and that backpacking backpack. So that's all my gear and I'll explain it all to you one by one. We'll start at the bottom right area. That's my collection of different, we'll call them tools. You want to call them knives? Well, I, I'll call them tools because they really, they're going to be used for something. Like my hatchet. Um, I've had this combat knife forever. So I keep it around. I always carry a pocket knife, another little knife, knife sharpener. This little pocket knife, it's a it's a Gerber. It's a cheap one. I mean, it's nothing major, but it has a little fire starter with it I thought was neat. Bought that knife at an auction. I don't always take it with me, but when I do, I uh, usually put it on my belt. Over here, I got my fanny pack. I know fanny packs are kind of cheesy, but they're, uh, they're pretty nice when you're hiking, especially when they have built-in cup holders where I put my Gatorade. And then this provides a big enough space where I could put my uh, DSLR camera and I could also put my extra SD cards and over here got a folding saw it's a cheap one you buy at a any any local retailer and that thing will come in handy if you find some you know dead uh, you know uh, bigger sticks or logs and you need to cut it to make a fire so uh, I recommend getting one of them then all this is all my camera gear all my GoPro gear I'm, I'm recording this on the camera it's a GoPro Hero 5 black so I can't show you that this is usually what I use to record it and it's a chest mount that's what I usually record my videos with. Then over here, I have dual battery chargers. I have five batteries total. I keep them all charged, so I, you know, make because these GoPro batteries they, they don't last that long. So I try to make sure I have plenty of them. I got assortment of different mounts, straps, uh, handlebar, bicycle type mount. These two things right here are a uh, battery. Um, Powered, you know, they, they, they I could charge my uh, batteries mobily, and I can also connect my cell phone to that one. And probably both of them. I don't know about the GoPro one, but that's extra power. You know, if all my batteries run down, you know, I can have that to charge them up. You know, and then I got assortment of different wires, little tripod mount, a uh, little smart remote. Another SD card. I'll be putting that in pretty soon. I paid a pretty penny for that. That's a big. Uh, that's a bigger SD card. It's 128 gigabytes. I paid quite a bit for that. And then, going up, these are bicycling gloves, padded and everything. I like them for hiking, so I carry them with me. I also carry an assortment of different trail bars. And they may not really be trail bars. I get them from the, you know, the health and fitness aisles. I like them. I like eating them. So that's why I take their protein. I always keep an extra pair of socks with me. That's my first aid kit. And it's just different stuff. There's soap. There's toothpaste, toothbrush, um, snake bite kit, rubber gloves, triple antibiotic ointment, scissors. Just basic you know, alcohol prep pads, basic stuff that you need in a first aid kit. It all come into a big box, but I'm, I try to, you know, reduce the weight as much as I can. I know this is a lot of stuff, but that's why I put it in a, in a little sandwich bag. 
Then over here, I got beef jerky. I always have beef jerky with me on my hikes. Um, you know, just something extra to eat on. I got my GPS Garmin 64 ST. I got my anemometer from Kestrel. And what that does, it measures temperature, wind speed, all that little weather stuff. I also got this device right here. It's from Robocop. It's called a sound grenade. It uh, emits a uh, 130 decibel alert and it's supposedly it can kind of ward off predatory animals. And I also have, I keep a can of off bug spray in the summer months. Um, keep a little in the winter months usually I keep that a little uh, beanie and that kind of also helps uh, uh, works as a towel you know I know it's little but you can use it to dry stuff off um, here's my water filtration system from Sawyer you can buy that pretty much anywhere a lot of people use that brand keep a li little whistle a little survival whistle with a compass on it and I think it's like a couple matches or something in, inside of it. That's cheap, really cheap, but hey, it's something. You know, you never know when you get lost or something, you need to whistle and try to help people. Um, try to get people to help you. Keep a little flashlight. It's nothing major. It's pretty bright. It's good, though, if, I, if I'm there past and I get lost or whatever, have some sort of light source. And going up to the last couple of items, I keep water purification tablets as an extra source of water purification uh, emergency survival blanket uh, that's a fire starter it's pretty good I've seen that in a lot of videos of other people my Shawnee National Forest maps keep them in a sandwich bag to keep the water off of it protect it finally I got a cheap mess kit that's like my cooking ware got a sport fork assembly thing in there and that's pretty much it as far as my gear goes um, I got quite a bit of stuff and I'm always looking for ways to uh, reduce the weight but yeah that's pretty much uh, my gear for when I go backpacking and hiking throughout southern Illinois and beyond and I do hope you have enjoyed this video thank you for watching my uh, backpack gear video um, I just want to end this video with saying I'm not trying to uh, promote any of the brands no one's paying me to you know promote I'm not none, none of these are my sponsors or anything like that I was just kind of showing you uh, what I have and uh, what I like to use some of it was you know pretty high in cost while others wasn't so high you know you don't have to get you don't have to buy the best of everything, but sometimes if you want something good, you're going to have to spend a little extra money. Um, but if you did like this video, please share it, please like it, and please feel free to leave a comment. And, you know, leave a comment telling me what you carry in your gear bag, because I'd love to know. You know, um, maybe I could get, give giving you ideas of what to carry. Your comments, you can probably give me new ideas of what else I should carry. Now, I gotta say, this is usually for just day hiking only, because um, obviously there's no tent, sleeping bag, so on and so forth, um, but that'd be a different video. So yeah, you know, share my video around with others, it'll help support me, it encourages me to keep going, and if you are not a subscriber to my channel, please subscribe today, because that really encourages me to keep uploading these videos. And uh, finally, uh, thanks for watching Hiking with Sean. Have a great day.